It's not that money won't make your life better, because it will. It's just that money can't solve what's fucked up about you. That's the fucking difference. Like, if you an alcoholic, and you ain't got but $20, you gonna get as fucked up as you can till you get to 20. Soon as you get to 20, last call. That's it. Now, imagine you that same alcoholic, you got a million dollars now. You just gonna be drinking and drinking and drinking and drinking and drinking. And drinking. You just gonna keep going till you run out. That's what's fucked up. That's why sometimes you don't want too much fucking money. Look what happened to Michael Jackson. He didn't mean to look like that. That wasn't his fucking plan. That's no. I'm telling you, that's not the face he thought he was gonna end up with. That's not how it worked. He just had too much fucking money. See, sometimes being broke is a motherfucking protection. You can't do all the fucked up stupid shit you thought about when you was high because you broke. And it protects you. If you a broke nigga with a big nose, you learn to live with your motherfucking big nose. Cause there ain't shit you can do about it. You just look at it and start, you start getting defensive about it. And bitch, if you don't like my big nose, get the fuck out my big nose face then. Bitch, I don't... But Michael had enough money, he could do whatever the fuck he thought. So instead of doing like we do, we only spend like seven seconds at the mirror. We just looking for bumps and, no, okay. This motherfucker got hours to spend in the mirror. He just in the mirror looking at his nose. Just. I hate my nose. I don't have to have this nose anymore. Then the motherfucker went to the doctor and he told the doctor exactly what the fuck he wanted his nose to look like. And that's exactly how the motherfucking doctor made his motherfucking nose. And then he get home, and now he in the mirror again. He look at Okay, the nose is right, but... These nose don't go with this... These nigga-ass cheekbones. It's... Jackson, we should have told you that nose ain't gold with them cheekbones. We, it's generally a set. I should have went ahead and did the whole, you know, essentially in here, you want me to go on and fix the chin and put a little John Travolta clap in that motherfucker for you? Fuck Michael. Now he, now that he in trouble, now this motherfucker got Muslims around him now. Now he look like a white woman surrounded by Muslims. This is bullshit. Y'all want to be no fucking nigga. Look, let me just say something. What I'm going to say about Michael next, a lot of y'all ain't going to like, and I just want you to know from the bottom of my heart, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> and white people don't understand danger. They just don't. You done seen the Discovery Channel. White people have no sense of danger at all. They just be looking right at the cobra. Just the cobra is right the fuck there. And they want to do an interview with the motherfucker. They don't look at his fangs. Look at the fangs. <laughs> it's not a nigga in here that's ever seen a wild animal close up. And niggas will cancel the whole trip. Just niggas have a bear or a big Rottweiler. <laughs> Nigga, I'm not sure. Let's leave. Let's leave. This is bullshit. We're not finished. <laughs> White people, you have got to get you some nigga friends. We are tired of seeing fucked up shit happen to y'all that could be prevented. All I'm saying, white people, look. Just because you have a mountain bike does not mean you are supposed to ride that motherfucker in the mountains. But that is the home of the mountain lion. Now do you see how simple it sounds? We are tired of white people getting attacked by shit and then they be on the news mad at the motherfucking lion. But we weren't even fucking with him. Bitch, you were in the drive through The lion was in the bush like, if these motherfuckers come through here one more motherfucking time, We love y'all. Y'all are the closest thing to being niggas that we have ever seen. Y'all work 
a bit too much. You making niggas look bad. We hate to see some goddamn Mexicans working. Just look at these show off motherfuckers. You gonna cut all the goddamn grass, Julio? This motherfucker just going from yard to yard. Dramatic. 